horizontal deflection and our right audio channel for vertical deflection. Now first we need a sine wave on our horizontal deflection channel and a cosine wave on our vertical deflection channel. Together they add up to a beautiful circle. We can alter its size and shape by increasing or decreasing the volume of both channels. Now we add a sawtooth wave to the right channel. Our circle turns into a spiral. To get this spiral into the shape of a mushroom, we need to multiply our left channel with a sine wave of the same frequency as the sawtooth. But we're only gonna use the sine's last quarter. Of course we want our mushroom to move. Just like in real life. That's why we now add another sawtooth multiplied with a cosine wave of a slightly different frequency to our left channel. can increase the number of mushrooms by dividing the cosine's frequency by two or even by three by randomly adding square waves we get even more mushrooms in fact we can plant an entire field 